Welcome back everyone, this is Jeroen, better known as Dutch Pond Fan, and I'm once again rejoined by my wonderful girlfriend, Lirit. Hi! Today we are watching 1965's Thunderball, our fourth uh, James Bond movie in this movie reaction series, uh, the fourth official Bond movie as well. Uh, you enjoyed Goldfinger a bit more last time. Yes, that's great. And what are you expecting? From Thunderbolt. I don't know. Maybe with a rocket or something. A rocket? Why a rocket? Or with a ball. I don't know. That's just what you <laughs> the associations you get with, with the title. Thunder. Yeah. Maybe. No clue. <laughs> <laughs> the cool thing is from here on in, um, you haven't seen well, most of them, from Thunderbolt all the way to The Living Daylights, you haven't seen. So that's yeah. number 4 to number 15, all of which are going to be first-time reactions. Yeah. If you are interested in the full-length reaction, you can find it on Patreon, so you can see the whole thing there. And without further ado, we're going to dive into Thunderbolt. This is the same one. No, this is the first time it's the new one. Now oh. it's Connery. Oh, he's still the James Bond in this now one. Now it's really Connery because they changed the aspect ratio for this movie to a wider screen. So they had to re-record the uh, gun barrel. Look, my initials on the coffin. No, you have also VD. Technically. <laughs> Who's this? The widow, but he notices something. Do you notice it? No. She's blonde? The way she got into the car. Backwards. She went like this. Everyone went, goes inside like with their head. No, you're, you're on the wrong track. You'll see. Uh. I've come to offer my sincere condolences. <coughs> My dear Colonel Bouvard, I don't think you should have opened that car door by yourself. He just killed him. Yep. That was the real Jack Bouvard. This is fake. Yeah, back projection. What's this? How awesome is that? That was a real jetpack. Yeah, this thing but is really flying. Did he just like put it there? Yeah, that's that's the thing I never got. How, did he do that in, like in advance? You know, that's the car. Uh, DB5, but very dirty. Yeah. Well done. It's underwater. Yes. Do you know? Do you? Who's singing this? I was gonna ask you. Uh. Tom Jones. You know him? Sex bomb, sex bomb. Oh, yeah. Or, uh, it's not unusual to be loved by anyone. <laughs> Same guy. They're in Paris! Yep. Wow, I love Paris. There will be no need. We have uh, certain funds from private individuals who share our... That's quite weird. They're in Paris, but they're speaking English. Yeah, this is an international company, but there's a secret to this company. Sit down, number two. We will discuss your nature project later. Who's this? Death of Spectre number six. Oh, Spectre! Our million three. Our expectations were considerably higher. But why? Do, I, do they have to pay or what? They bring money in from all kinds of criminal activities. He's going to kill him? But it's always the one you don't expect. Hmm. In about half an hour, Pat. I'll be ready. I've heard that before. Now he saw it's from Spectre, right? It's not, for, it's not a Spectre tattoo, but it is from something criminal. Spectre's logo is the octopus. Oh, yeah. 
Egg. Menfen. Next time I see you, I'll put you across my knee. On yogurt and lemon juice? Uh, he's going to follow them. Oh, he's going into his room. Yeah. But uh, obviously... He <gasps> There's someone forward. coming! <laughs> Get behind the curtain! Who's that? Who's that? It's not yet revealed. Well, I'd never have recognized myself. <laughs> Do I seem healthy? Too healthy by far. He does his hand like hair. Behave yourself, Mr. Mm, this is salty. <laughs> yeah. See, there's only one place to keep you quiet. There now. First time I felt really safe all day. She's basically he molested her, and, and yes. she's like, behave yourself. Like nowadays, he would be facing court probably. Yeah. <laughs> Why would there even be a danger setting? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, where were you? Bitch? Well, I... I suppose my silence could have a price. Do you mean... Oh, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he just blackmails her. Major Deval's social secretary. My cast here at Judy Calls. The story of my life. You'll be late at the airbase. This is the bad guy? No, you'll see. Mm-hmm. Your coat, sir. Nice dress. Be good. Oh, he's a pilot. Take it back. Huh? It's the same guy. <laughs> That's that guy who was with the... Right. He had plastic surgery to look like him. Yeah. Make it a quarter of a million. Or get someone else. There is no one else. Exactly. The rest of my money. Just have it ready. They don't do this. Flying a Vulcan at an altitude of 45,000 feet, armed with two atomic bombs, MOS type. Atomic bombs? Why do they do that in an airplane? Why do they do that in a test flight? Yes. That's what I never got. So now comes the plan. What do you think so they're going to do with the atomic bombs, Spectre? Uh, they will drop it. Why? To kill. No, no. Think, think bigger. I don't know. <laughs> They're all dead. Yeah. Came from about here. She is armed, isn't she? Two atomic weapons are MOS type. Get everything you can in. A test flight who is armed. Right. That's the part I never got. The Spectre. Yeah, Mr. Largo. That was in Paris before, you know, with the eye patch. This is so weird. They have like a runway in water. Yeah. They're gonna kill him. Why would they kill him? Because he is not necessary anymore. You think Spectre is that ruthless? Yeah. He saw that with number nine. He has to turn it. Maybe it's stuck. He would know, right? He's a certified pilot. You were right. <laughs> Was to be expected, probably. And of course they have a boat with two like perfectly placed, perfectly for, placed nuclear for a weapons. nuclear bomb. <laughs> Here, handle like eggs, it says on the bomb. You saw that? Yes. I saw it. Would that say so on real bombs? Handle no. like eggs. <laughs> <laughs> I think not. <laughs> Put this over the aircraft so nobody can see it. Right, to hide it more. And this boat has an Italian name as well, the Disco Volante, which means a oh, flying yeah, saucer. Oh yeah, you see it. Flying saucer in um, English. And Alfa Romeo is also called Disco Volante.
Who do you think killed him? The girl. She is the first true, true bad femme fatale in the series. Every double O man in Europe's been rushed in, and the Home Secretary too. That's so why he's probably lost a dog. <laughs> We, we can't see the other one's faces. Not really. But there is a 0011 as well in, mentioned in other we, movies. But so. we never see their faces now. Just a little bit. Every time I bounce. Your acceptance of our terms by arranging for oh, we saw them! Strike. Oh, they were like, with the painting. That's the circle the bombs could be located in. Yeah. Flying range of the Vulcan. Extensive search <laughs> has failed to locate any evidence. Code name? Thunderball. Ah. <laughs> it's the name of the mission. Last night at Shrublands, he was dead. That's enough for me to initiate inquiries. And immediately believes him. That's the cool yeah. thing. Yeah. Do you think she's worth going after? I wouldn't have put it quite that way, sir. <laughs> We've only got four days, 007. How else will you recognize her? Couldn't miss. She has two moles on the left thigh. <laughs> he would find out. It's not funny, but okay. Yes, it is. <laughs> you ever been to the Bahamas? No. I want to go there. It's definitely a, a Bond location. Starfish. You can't just pick up a starfish like that, right? They bite. They do? Paula, give me a hand, will you? Get. Maybe you recognize Paula as well. She appeared in a previous movie. She was one of the two gypsy girls. In oh, family. yes. And now she's in the Bahamas. She's playing someone else. Who's this? Is he from Spectre? Likely. Oh, from Spectre. So, what sharp little eyes you've got. Wait till you get to my teeth. <laughs> he's just like a disgusting man. No, he's smooth. No, he's, really he's smooth. like molesting girls. And he has smooth. disgusting, like, I, I love his line. Sentence. Line. Brother now. In England, he's a commandant with the NATO forces there. He's a wonderful person. He's dead, right? Yeah, he doesn't. He killed yet. him. No, that was the guy, the imposter with the door. Oh, oh Remember yeah. the red yeah. one? Who's that? The guy with the sunglasses. Yeah. Who do you think he is? I don't know. Too much characters in this one. Yeah, good point. In Doctor No, you immediately. Um, CIA. Uh, yes. Look at this pool. The sharks. In a pool. Such a Bond villain thing, right? They're gonna throw him in, in the shark pool. No! This is the uh, news. Yeah, but they, so they did strike, so they did agree with the ransom money. So they have to find the bombs fast. Oh no. Ah, 007. <laughs> what a wonderful surprise. Well, this business of equipping you in the field, on the run as it were, highly irregular. Now he does, but that becomes regular. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to equip him in the field. What's that? With special care. Everything you can do. the water. Contempt. Yes, I know, but that takes eight pictures in rapid succession by pressing that button there. Only eight? Is that clever? But if you can take pictures in the dark with an infrared film, yes. Obviously, you'll only use it as oh, a Oh, that's resort. like a... Uh, breathing apparatus. Breathing in underwater. Lots of underwater in this movie, right? Mm-hmm. 
This was one of the first movies where they had underwater cameras, so they wanted to show that new technology oh, a lot. Found her to find <laughs> It's so weird because you, you are using hand grenades like 10 meters of your boat. Yeah, it could destroy your boat, you yes. mean. Yes. You just put that thing off. Look at that. Oh, must have hit him with a propeller. Let's get back into Largo. Classic Bond villain mistake, right? They just assume Bond is dead. My outboard capsized, so I had to swim ashore. Is this that girl from the... Spectre. Oh, from Spectre. They all look, they look similar. Right? This is the redhead, Fiona Volpe. Ah, this is... Fly here often? <laughs> this is the road to Nassau. Yes. Eventually. Just kill her already! No, you see, I've always been a nervous passenger. Some men just don't like to be driven. No, some men just don't like to be taken for a ride. <laughs> About 90 miles is the limit for six hours, and that's out and back. But they put like a... A net. Survival net on it. Yeah. The story again is pretty simple, like two bombs have been hijacked, the world is in ransom and Bond has to find the bombs. Well, not only Bond. And, you know, Other find the people responsible. double O's have to find it also. Yeah, of course, but it's a Bond movie, so it's about his, his adventure. Looks more fitting for a woman. Do you know much about guns, Mr. Bond? No, I know a little about women. <laughs> Oh! Seems terribly difficult. <laughs> no, it isn't, is it? Opinion of himself. Opinion. Where are they now? Yes. The hotel room of he Mr. Bond. Me too. Who's she? And who's she? This is oh, Cola she? and Fiona. Yeah. And who's Fiona? The redhead. The evil girl. Bond has had to kill her yesterday evening. Now Paula is dead. I don't give a damn about the rest of the island. I just want the lights out in Palmyra. You'll have it. They know something happened with Paula. They didn't kill Paula yet. No, they She's used your phone. So soft. Yeah, I noticed too. It's that so didn't weird. make a sound. Mm -hmm. Search that way. And you, the shot. And now it's closed. Oh, yeah. Was it closed? No, he did like open it and then he ran. He ran. Hmm. What sharp little eyes you've got. Ah. Is this the shark pool? Or oh, yeah, it's the shark pool. <laughs> no, this oh, it's is not. This is the pool. other one. But they're gonna do this. The pools are connected with a tunnel. Oh, now he's bleeding. Yeah. Blood in the tank. There they come. He has to go to the tunnel hatch. Yeah, but. But what? There are sharks. Two. There were four, right? There's the other one. Sorry, old chap. Better luck next time. That was number four. I'll get back to him just as soon as I can. Anything else? Tell him Paula's dead. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but here. But someone else checked in. You see the. Yes. Would you mind giving me something to put on?
<laughs> I would throw it in his face. Ordinary. Shouldn't you get out those wet clothes? You'll catch your death of cold. Do you think, just like Pussy Galore, he, he can win her over? No. What a blow it must have been. You having a failure. Well, you can't win them all. I already said it. Like, he can't win her over. <laughs> Yeah. Are you rooting for the villains now? <laughs> Why are you rooting for the villains now? Because he slept with her? <laughs> no, because he's disgusting in this movie. All the se all the sex. She goes naked in no. his bed in his all hotel room. Sexy sentence. He's funny. That's not funny. How did they find him so fast? He's being watched everywhere on the parade. I think the junk canoe oh, mad, is a real parade in the Bahamas. Yes, I think it's not fiction. No good, you're trying to escape, Mr. Bond. I don't want to escape. She's a good villain, right? She's pretty convincing. Who's this? The Spectre people on her side trying to kill Bond. And then he does like this. He's gonna swift her around? Gotcha. Right between his fingers too. He used her as a shield. One of my friend's sisters went out. She's just dead. <laughs> So they have to find the bombs quick now. But they're now looking for the aircraft. Yeah, mainly the bombs. The, but the bombs the are already in the boat, yeah, right? You know, yeah. <gasps> I wonder if they really harmed a real shark for this yeah. one. I don't think they did. Uh, I'm not sure actually, to be honest. I hope not. I'm sure they didn't kill a, an innocent animal for the movie. Would you have the guts to swim with sharks? Nope. You? Uh, I would like to say I would, but probably would be too scared. <laughs> I do know they don't really harm you that fast, unless you, or unless you're <laughs> bleeding, unless you're bleeding, <sighs> or you know if there's like a really crazy one. Who are you going to ask, Largo? No. No. I don't think we'll have to. This bikini, I find the best Bond bikini in the series, so does, I wonder what you think of it, knowing your fashion sense. So they kind of have underwater sex. I don't know how that would work. I don't know either. <laughs> I don't know either. Ow! The egg spines, they're poisonous. Here, yeah. Open your arm. I'm sorry, James. I didn't mean to. What do you think of the bikini? Nice. Beautiful. But I liked her uh, bathing suit. Yeah, she, she's. I, I think she's the best looking Bond girl of the 60s. Francois. He's dead. No, he gave it just like fun to give it to you. If it starts clicking, it means the bombs are aboard. See, now the camera is also a Geiger counter. Yes. That was the watch before. Does he do it? How did he get that right over there? I think he got the point. Yeah. But who never 
saw them putting it right over here. Yeah, that would kind of ruin it if we already know everything, right? And then Bond, and then we're just waiting for Bond to catch up. Yeah. He found him, right? Yeah. Lord recognizes him. It's Bond. Somewhere there is that thing, right? Or is that only at the outside? Like the lever? Yeah. I don't know. But hear me. Where did you get that? I bought it this morning. Let me see. No, why should I? No, my dear. There is no escape for you. Like your friend, you've been a little too clever. And now you are caught! What is going to do with her? Uh -huh. Hmm? He's going to kill her? Orlando Beach! Warn them the target is Miami! Why Miami? Yeah. Right. But why? Today, oh, today we're going to pick a major world. city. Oh, it's the closest to the Bahamas. And also in the book, they guessed it was going to be an American city because they uh, they found out that Spectre is Europe-based. But in the movies, all of that isn't explained. Mm -hmm. Who are these? The troops of NATO to try and stop, try and stop them. At least they're wearing orange and black, so we can tell them apart. <laughs> Have you ever seen something like this? No. Like an underwater war? <laughs> Me neither. It's, I think this is the only movie I, I ever saw something like that. through his neck, I think. Yellow? Now Bond comes in to help. But why yellow? I don't know. Looks cool though. What was that? Like a rocket, I think. Yes. Where are they? In the old submarine? Yeah, like a shipwreck. Going to set it on fire. Like on the water? Oh, that's what you mean. Poof! And he closed the engine. Yep, lured him in the trap. <laughs> but he doesn't have like his tanks, so he does it on his own breath. Yeah, he has the mini apparatus. Oh, on. yes, of course. Right in the eye. Yes. Ah! It's right in the head. Yeah. And there's blood in the water as well. It's a second shark that seems to be heard in the, the movie. This I always find stupid in movies. What? To put on a different... And now it's empty. The glasses are empty. There's no water inside. Yeah, it, like you can't put on a different glasses underwater, that's always uh, movie logic. Where is Lago? Oh, uh, oh, he's escaping. Yeah, back to the ship. Now he's dead by number one. Number one, he's going to kill him. Who, Lago? Yeah. Do you remember the real name of number one that you saw in the credits of From Russia With Love? Hmm. 
That's cool, right? It's a hydrofoil boat. And Bond is here. Look, he's climbing on the, um, the the outside of the hydrofoil. <laughs> They're gonna die. Yeah. Good luck fighting the Marines. Yeah. Exploded now. I threw the arming device into the seat. Do you understand? Yes. So this bomb that he has can never go off because he already put it in the sea. Yeah, that's what he said. <laughs> that's fast. I don't know, is this real or fake? Well, what do you think? <laughs> fake. Jesus Christ! That's really sped up. Yeah, she comes. I'm glad I killed him. You're glad? Who's he? I don't know, but he helped me. Come on, I'm trying to learn to swim! Never too late to learn. <laughs> gone <laughs> never too late to learn to swim yeah and what happened to the guy anyway yeah it's so weird because he's gone he had no significant role he shows up he was the guy to detonate the bombs they just throw him away and he's not even rescued no the bombs still active and the boat was like in the rocks so the world is saved. Not only because of Bond. No, with the help of Domino. Usually and that the, guy. And the guy who we don't know the name of. So strange. Where's that guy? Where's the guy from Spectre? This time he's not credited. You were no. looking for his name again? Yes. Maybe next time. You'll find out. We finished watching Thunderbolt just now. Yes. Um, as always, I'm going to start with your thoughts about this movie. Like your overall <laughs> thoughts. Too many characters. <laughs> That's a really fair criticism, honestly, actually. Yeah, I was like, who's this? And who's that? <laughs> Oh, is she bad? Oh, I thought she was good. <laughs> yeah, you kept mixing up Viona and Domino at some at some cases even. Yeah. Like they look similar, even though the one to me they don't. But I've have seen that before. But you saw this movie like a million times. This That's for me, this is yeah. for me the first time. Right. Now, very fair criticism. Uh, any any other thoughts come to mind for overall of this movie or? Yes. The Bond villain, the girl, she, she like, stood like, nope, I'm still bad, yeah. I'm bad. Even if Bond sleeps with me. Yeah, you can't turn me. Yeah, to me, um, she's the highlight to this film, to me. She's the, the best character, I okay. think. Okay. Um, yeah, so, you, you want to get into your rating? We're going to start okay. with Bond's performance, as always. Uh, what did you rate uh, Bond this time? Four. Four stars, just like in Goldfinger. Okay. Yes, I thought giving him three stars, but that's just his lines that he has to say. But his performance overall to play Bond, it was good, but his lines... You weren't a fan of the dialogue no, this time. No, not at all. That's not funny. Because you see it in a way from like guys. Right. And I see it as a way from girls. Right. So you're kind of turned off by the, yes. the, the, the talking. It was too much. Yeah. Too much too <laughs> yeah. much. <laughs> yeah. A lot of jokes in this one. A lot of... Uh, Sexism jokes. Yeah. Yes. For you it's funny because you're a guy. Yeah. But for me in this time... It was not funny. Maybe in uh, like the sixties. Yeah. I think it was funny, but I don't know. Yeah, 
he also kind of you know molests the guy in the beginning of the, the girl <laughs> i mean in the beginning of the the movie uh, at the health spa he just you know he just kisses he her he just grabbed her yeah. and i was like and then <laughs> she almost lost her job and then he just blackmails her into sex yes. so, that, so that he remains quiet <laughs> yeah the 60s fair very fair actually um you you're still a fan of connery as bond or yes, are you turned off yes he plays it now? quite well but the lines yeah. Not every scene has to be like with a with that kind of lines. No, I I completely see where you're coming from. Um, okay, shall we move on to the next one? Yeah, so the Bond girls of this movie. Yeah, there were two, but one of them died. <laughs> right. Yeah, Paula. Yeah. Uh, Paula. She was more like a side character, and of course, the 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 real main Bond girl, so to speak, was uh, Dominique Duval, better known as Domino. Yeah. The sister of the, 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 the pilot. pilot. Yeah, right. Francois okay. Derval. Yeah. Yeah. What did you think of her? Beautiful. I agree. Yeah. 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 So I gave her and the other one three stars. Right. Any, anything more on her you want to mention or? Her bathing suit. <laughs> Basically the way she looked. Yeah. yeah. Anything interesting about her character as well? Did, did she stand out or...? No, I mixed them up. Yeah, they look too similar to you maybe. Yeah. Oh. Okay. And I didn't know where Paula was came from, so... Paula was just the assistant working for MI6 with Bond. Uh, and she was already on the island. Yeah, I guess so. I guess she must have already... That, that's because never explained. we didn't got an intro of her. She no, was she like, was just on the boat. I'm here! Yeah. Helping Bond. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, I completely agree. I, I, I honestly feel like Fundable has the best lineup of Bond girls looks-wise. They're okay. all beautiful women, I think. Mm -hmm. Like Domino, the Health Spa girl, Paula, Viona Volpe, they're all... They are obviously casted uh, for their looks as well, um, but the other one, Viona Volpe, which we kind of already talked about, we're going to the Bond That's the villains bad guy, now. The yeah. bad girl, right? The Bond villains, Largo and Viona Volpe mainly. And Spectre. And Spectre as well. They were all working for Spectre. Four stars. Four stars for the villains in Fundable. Uh, yes. All right, explain. Uh, she was the first real bad girl right i i agree <laughs> and she remained bad right. until the end of the movie when she died <laughs> yeah she was you're completely spot on there we've seen like you talked about pussy galore kind of being bad but then she she, she wasn't really like mm -hmm. like domino she was yeah. just in the camp of the villains yeah but viona volpe is pure evil basically yeah she had also the ring yeah and in the beginning of the movie, I saw like the tattoo and I was like, oh, that's Spectre, he knows it's Spectre. But you said, no, Spectre is like the, the octopus. Yes, she has the octopus ring. So Fiona Volpe stood out to you. Yes. Yes. And then you had Spectre. And in the beginning, I was like very disorientated where I'm like, huh? <laughs> okay, they were in Paris. Yeah. At the bank, where they speak English instead of French. <laughs> that was a company, like a front for Spectre. And then in the back room, there was the secret uh, Spectre room where they um, yeah. had all the... And we saw the cat again. Yep, from the head of Spectre. But you forgot what his name was. Yeah, I still don't know. <laughs> you did know in uh, From Russia With Love in the credits, because it was shown there. Do you think do you think um, he's going to appear again, number one? I think so. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. It's like the last movie, right? The the yeah. The, the, obviously, Spectre. in the last movie is called Spectre. But in you you think he's going to appear uh, in the old movies? Yes, I think. Okay, we'll I see think, soon. I don't know. Uh, there's one more villain we haven't talked about, the main one, obviously, Emilio Largo. Um, oh, yes, the number two, right? Number two, Spectre, yes. With the eye patch. Yeah. Yeah. What did you think? Yeah, 
He looked like a villain. I don't know. Did he stand out to you <laughs> or just a basic villain? Yes, he looked like a villain but yeah. nothing special. Yeah, so the, the four stars are mainly earned by Fiona Volpe to Yes, you. because he did also like swimming and diving underwater, but he's like number two, right? He's yeah. an important man. Why does he do his things by himself? You think his minions should do um, yes. all the swimming? Yeah, good point. He, he, you know, he should if be I sitting was behind a villain, the desk. Yeah. I was like, you do like uh, swimming and diving. I will put like you over there, over there, over there, and I will, yeah. I will sit right you over there. You were expecting him to be more like that. Yes. He was also involved in the action. Yeah. Okay. Everywhere. Yeah. True. So Viona Volpe uh, earned the four stars here mm -hmm. for uh, Lirit. Uh, moving on to the locations. Yes. What did you think? Four stars. Another four stars here. Yes. Uh, so the Bahamas this the time. Bahamas. Tropical setting in front of all. Yes. Yeah. And mainly underwater. A lot of underwater scenes. Yeah. yeah. But the Bahamas. Very yeah. beautiful. I agree. Yeah. And, they and also was it also in London? Yeah, bits of it. Yeah, we didn't see too much of no. them. And we saw also the other double O's. Yeah. Did you think that was cool that, to see like the, the importance of this mission? Yeah. Yeah, uh, the, in the movies, they well, actually in the books, there's, there's only three. In the movies, they, they well, they show it's here strange. it's nine, but yeah. In the books, it was 003, 007 and 0011, I think. Something like that. So the other ones died. They never explain how they, they were just no. free in the books, but in here they show nine. Okay, uh, the Junkanoo parade was also present in the locations. Yeah, it looked like the Brazilian carnival. Right. Yeah. Yeah. No, I agree. In uh, like a Rio de Janeiro. Yeah. Which may or may not also appear in a future Bond movie. Moving on to the story of the, the film. Yes. What did you think? I gave it three stars. Three stars, okay. Tell us about what you thought about the story. It, it was a typical Bond movie, but yeah, there were too many, too many characters. Right. And I gave, um, well, it has to do with the enjoyment. We'll give the expl same explanation. Oh, okay, okay. So the story is uh, free and we move on to the enjoyment, which you gave. Two. Two, okay. Yes. <laughs> so your story and enjoyment is kind of connected. Yeah. Um, you didn't enjoy it too much. No. Well, tell us about it. Uh, tell us about it. Yeah. Well, I got confused very much. <laughs> because of all the characters, maybe. Yes. And the location, it was beautiful, but I was like, oh, they're now in a cave. Why are they in a cave? Oh, there are bombs in the cave, but I never saw bombs that they put the bombs over there. Oh, okay. And now they're on the sea, okay. And now they're in the house. And now they're on the party because he was like chased by the bad guys. It was too many to connect. All over the place for yeah. you. Okay. It was well in one place in the Bahamas. <laughs> Did you think the movie um, um, was a bit too slow? Too, or at least that's my. What, what do you think? Well, that's your opinion. Too mm -hmm. slow. Um, well, uh, a little bit too slow, but yeah, I don't know. Okay. A little bit too slow. Yeah. But not that much. It's not like. Uh, well, I think the from Russian with love that was too long. Okay, did you found that to be a bit slower even? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I feel the story is less complicated this time. You know, bombs are stolen. Bond needs to find them. That's basically it. Yeah, but, but they are like. They 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 make it convolu convoluted to follow. Maybe yes. in your opinion. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Um, anything else to add before we go to the final they score? They had a lot of sex in this movie. That they did, yeah. Alright, so that brings the <laughs> final score of Lirits for Thunderbolt to three stars. But there was nothing with thunder. 
And nothing with balls. Yeah, you completely <laughs> got that wrong. That was just the name of the operation to yeah. find the bombs. Okay, um, so three stars. Uh, we hope yeah. you once again enjoyed. Uh, next time we're going to be watching the next Connery movie. Do you have any clue what that is called? No. It's called... You... I think... I you can see it on the poster. You only live twice. Yes, that's up next. We hope you enjoyed. Well, that's not correct. Take care guys. <laughs> see you guys later. <laughs> Bye!